Wow, they taste like waffles. These are so good. The easiest things to make. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Myra from Low Carb Love. Now, for those of you that don't know, I've lost over 100 pounds by making healthier versions of some of my favorite foods. So today, I'm gonna show you how I make waffles. Now, these are not only weight loss friendly, they're high in protein, but they're also just made with two ingredients. So sometimes, I feel like if you wanna make like a homemade waffle, it could be a little intimidating because you have to do the mixture. And if you're making it from scratch, then you're gonna be using a lot of ingredients. So this one here, it is homemade, very clean, super healthy, and all we're gonna use are eggs and an almond butter. Now, you can probably make this with peanut butter, but the almond butter has a little bit more of a neutral taste. And I feel like the texture overall just works a little better with the almond butter but if all you have is peanut butter, you can still make it, okay? So, I already have my almond butter measured out, so literally just toss this into the bowl, okay? And I'll leave all the measurements in the description below, so don't worry about that. And I'm just going to add in our eggs, okay? So obviously the hardest part here is just mixing everything together, and I'm gonna be making mini waffles, but if you just have a big waffle maker, then you're gonna make big waffles. If you wanna add in, I mean, vanilla, you can add in like an almond flavor. I mean, whatever your little heart desires, you can totally add that in. So let me just mix this up. I'll show you right now what the consistency will look like before we cook it. Okay, so this is what we're looking for in terms of texture. And you can use butter. I'm gonna use a little bit of avocado oil just so it doesn't stick. And right in the middle. You don't wanna overfill this because it will expand and then it'll just go over. Close it up. Look at that, it looks beautiful. It has a really nice, um, it just has like a really nice texture where it feels like there's a little crust on the outside and then it's nice and fluffy on the inside. So I feel like if you love waffles and you're like a waffle person, you should give it a try. It's high in protein, it's something really nutritious, super easy. It's one of those things that kids love, adults love. It's like a crowd pleaser type breakfast, you know? Put a little bacon on the side, some berries. I honestly think that they feel so much better than regular waffles. So I'm just gonna go ahead and finish making the rest of them and then I'll show you when they're all done. Okay, so look at this gorgeous plate of waffles. This reminds me of like the egg, Lego my Ego commercial from back in the day. They're just so perfect. This is really like, I've made a lot of low carb um, waffle recipes and this one here, looks and feels the absolute best. So I'm going to, I mean, you obviously top your waffles off with whatever you want. I am definitely a butter person. Like I love waffles with butter, syrup. Of course you can do the whole berries, which I do have there, but I wanna taste it just alone. Cheers. Wow, it's crazy how you can make a recipe like this with just two ingredients that taste just like regular waffles that are made with like 10 ingredients. They're a little fluffier than a regular waffle, but a thousand percent, they taste like waffles. These are so good. The easiest things to make, knock them out. But like this one's so cute, these are like tiny and my little mini waffle maker, which this one here I grabbed on Amazon. I'll leave it linked for you because it's a little le leopard one. Obviously, you're gonna eat them however you want, but I just wanted to show you that you could make waffles with just two ingredients that are gonna keep you on track. They're gonna hit the spot when you're actually craving waffles. They are super clean and nutritious. Like they're high in protein, low in calories, low in carbs. They're just like, they hit every, every checkbox. 
whether they're my cups or like in this case, the little waffle maker, I try to leave it linked for you just so that you don't have to go and look for it. But um, I hope you really enjoyed this recipe. It's delicious. When you make it, come back and comment down below. Let me know what you think. I hope you really enjoy it. If you have friends and family that are living a low carb lifestyle, maybe diabetic, um, share my channel, share this recipe with them. You never know, it could be really, really helpful. But thank you so much for being here. I love you and I will see you on my next video. Mwah.